All right, welcome back to another Adobe Photoshop tutorial, guys. This one, I'm going to show you how to lighten the eye color or to change eye color, but more or less lighten it. So let's say in this situation, I've loaded up a picture off Pixabay. It's a free image to download, and it's this nice looking girl, and we want to make her eye color a little lighter, and we don't want to spend all day messing around. So the first step that I like to do is I'm going to make a copy of the layer, and I'm going to duplicate it, pardon me. So I have a duplicate on top, and then I'm going to turn the bottom one off. And I like to do that because it's easier for me to show you my work at the end when I'm done. That's not a necessary step, though. All right. Now let's get into the necessary stuff. The first step is I want to zoom in to the eye. So let's go in nice and zoomy, zoomy. So right about there. That sounds about right. And if you guys, I'm using my MacBook Pro and I pinch zoom with my fingers. But if you can't do that, you can always use the traditional zoom tool, which is right there. Next step, guys, is we want to create an adjustment layer, and not just any old adjustment layer. We're going to create a brightness adjustment layer. We're going to brighten this a lot. And I'm going to do it extra, so I'm going to go up to like 80. I'm going to go up to 90. I wouldn't normally go this bright, but because we're doing a demonstration here and I'm teaching a technique, we're going to go up nice and bright so you can see it a little better when we're done. So let's go with a brightness of, I don't know, whatever, 89, 91. Let's go with 89. Okay, cool. And I am going to close that up. Now, the whole thing is brighter, and that's not what we wanted. We just want the eye to be brighter. So we got to do another couple steps. So the next step is I am going to go to Edit, and then you go down to Fill. And this is a little weird because I, I'm not real, it, it takes a little while to get used to this, but I'm going to fill now the whole thing up with black. So we're going to put a black mask on it, and boom, we've got a mask, we've got black applied to it. Now, we've kind of like gone brightened and then we darken it, right? But this is the point. We're going to click on this mask here. The next step, and this is the important one, is we want to go down to the bottom here and add a vector mask or add mask. When I click on that, boom, we're going to have some color here. Now, the next step is we want to take our paintbrush. That's right, guys. We want to take the paintbrush, and now we're going to be painting with white. So we are going to go ahead and paint out the parts of the eye that, you know, we want to be brighter. So I'm going to go ahead and do that, and then watch. So I'm painting around the eye. Now, this is not perfect because I'm just showing you how to do it. I'm not going to sit here and like get out my fine-tuned brushes and all that crazy stuff. But I'm just going to go in and nice and do like a really rough, rough version of it. Okay, I wouldn't do that, actually. That got her iris or whatever the hell that's called in there. Okay, so I've painted it a little. Now the part up at the top, I would actually, if this was, I would then switch the brushes. I would switch back to black, and I would go ahead and reduce the size of my brush because this is getting into some really fine-looking stuff. And now I'm painting with black, so I'm putting the dark back in here. And you know what? I think we're getting kind of close. And again, this is not meant to be perfect. I am just doing this to show the technique as we said here. Maybe a little bit up here because this should be somewhat circular. What do you think? Yeah, something like that. Maybe. What do you think? Okay, I don't even know. <laughs> it's going to look good though. And then I'm going to go over to this tool. And now I'm going to zoom out. And you're going to see something you're going to see that what was a dark eye, like the one on her, her left eye, is now this color. And we just did that in about one or two minutes. That's it. And if I turn this top layer off, this was the original. This is the modification. We turned her into a White Walker, guys. That's all there is to it. Pretty simple. We got this thing rolling. That's it, guys. I got a lot more tutorials coming up. Be back soon.